CSIRO research vessel Investigator has recovered a state-of-the-art robotic float, known as an Argo float, from the Southern Ocean for the first time. The two-metre-long float has been on a three-year mission sampling deep waters south of Tasmania. Argo floats take measurements as they drift up to two kilometres below the waves, surfacing every 10 days to transmit data via satellite before diving down again. But finding and recovering such a tiny float in the deep blue sea is a bit like looking for a needle in a haystack and requires all eyes on deck. While the float sent out frequent GPS coordinates, keen-eyed spotters took to binoculars to help the captain steer the ship into its path. It was a tricky dance between wind and currents and took careful coordination to catch the 100 kilogram float with a small net. The trampoline-like net was also having its first debut in the wild, with the crew having no idea how it might behave in the swell. Luckily, after a couple of attempts, the team had success. With the float on board, scientists now have access to valuable data on temperature, salinity, oxygen and pH of seawater, and the amount of light and nutrients at different depths. It also has a camera that's taken pictures of particles along the way. Another win is that this float can now be cleaned up and redeployed with fresh batteries, giving it a second life. Ultimately, the rich data it contains is priceless, revealing how much carbon the ocean stores and how that might change in the future.